Hey everyone, what's going on? This is just a quick follow-up video. I really need to get some sleep tonight, but uh, recently I made this video about the Tiger King show that's on Netflix and how it was scripted by an ancient practice knowledge known as gematria, the practice of coding numbers into words and phrases. And in this video, I also talked about how you know, there's some type like tiger theme that's synced up to coronavirus and the royal family. And I even mentioned how Tiger Woods is important and Tiger Woods is also synced up to Kobe Bryant. And the day after I posted this video, we got a story about a tiger in the Bronx Zoo that got coronavirus. And then the next day after that, we got a story of the Detroit Tiger player named Al Kaline, or don't know how to pronounce his name, but a Detroit Tiger player died. You know, talking about Tiger King, and there's this tiger theme with coronavirus, and then a tiger gets coronavirus, and why would they even test a tiger when they're not even testing all humans? You know, it's just a sensational story in the media to get people all worried and worked up about nonsense, you know, and... Then the Detroit Tiger dies, and you can check these videos out. I don't want to re-explain everything, but I just went to ESPN a little bit ago, and notice today on the headline articles over here, Tiger enjoys champion's dinner, and then they put in quotations, quarantine style. And it brings up this article here with Tiger Woods, of all people, right? Tiger King, Tiger with Coronavirus, Detroit Tigers player dies. Now we get a story about Tiger Woods. And notice how they put this quarantine style. And in this language of Gematria, if you write out quarantine style, it just so happens to equal 201. And this was the number that I was talking about why tigers were important to the coronavirus stuff. Tiger equals 201, and a number of other things. There was, you know, event 201 that Bill Gate, Bill and Melinda Gates had hosted, and it was about a coronavirus outbreak that would kill 65 million people, and, you know, that's where the word pandemic equals 65 in Gematria, and that's why Donald Trump declared it a national emergency on 313, because that's the 65th prime number, and... Much, much more with that. But it was event 201. That's also 201 days before the date of May 6th, which can also be written as 6 slash 5, 5 slash 6. And coronavirus equals 56. So does toilet paper, you know. Toilet paper equals 56. It's all a scripted joke, you know. And, you know, just more all the story. If you go back and watch the videos, I talk all about the number 201. How it synced up to Tiger. Even I even made this blog post on April 1st, right? And in the blog post, I wrote about Tiger Woods down here. Event 201, Tiger Woods, you know? What are the odds? And what sticks out to me even more is last year, Tiger Woods won the Masters. And it was all about the number 22. He won the last time that he, the first time he won a Masters was 22 years before. And the last time that he won a Majors was 11 years before. And in numerology, the Master numbers are 11 and 22. And then the word Woods equals 22. The word Golf equals 22. The word Master equals 22. And I bring all of this up because in my Tiger King post and my Tiger King stuff, it was all about 22. This Joe Exotic, he got sentenced to 22 years on the 22nd day of the year. Also, if you watch the show, he says that they're trying to put him away for 79 years. And I can't remember what episode it is, the very last episode. 79 years, the 22nd prime number is 79. He was also married to a 22-year-old named... Dylan Passage, he got married when they were he was 22 years old. It's all about how he tried to kill this Carol Baskin lady. Carol Baskin in Gematria equals 79, and the show came out 79 days before her birthday. 
And the big thing was that she supposedly killed her husband back in 1997, which was 22 years before this show came out. And the 22nd anniversary of this show just so happened to be, Joe Exotic will just so happen to be 79 years old. And this lady's company, Big Cat Rescue, it came out, it was founded on November 4th, and he was sentenced 79 days after the anniversary of that. You know, there's all kinds of stuff with the number 22. And, you know, I, I talked about how Corona means crown, and there's this big king symbolism going on, and the word king equals 22, and... I talked about how all of that was synced up to Kobe Bryant with the crown tattoo on his arm being buried in Corona Del Mar and LeBron King James and Luke Walton leaving the Lakers to go coach the Kings. And, you know, it stems back to China and coronavirus. And in 2017, I talked about how the death of China Thomas was synced up to Kobe Bryant and the Houston Rockets and a number of things. And her brother Isaiah Thomas was number 22 for the Sacramento Kings, and his sister died at the age of 22 in King County, Washington, and that is where the coronavirus began, was in Seattle, right, in the United States, so, you know, this royal family symbolism synced up to all of what is going on here, and, you know, that's also why I thought of Tiger Woods, you know, he's the most famous tiger you can think of, Tiger Woods, and he, he's super synced up to Kobe Bryant. If you remember, he did the, uh, let me find it here. There was, when after Kobe Bryant died, Tiger Woods made this 24 feet, 8 inch eagle putt in Los Angeles. And, you know, there was all kinds of number tributes to Kobe too, if you just go back and think about it. You know, if you don't think this exists, I mean, every person was like, oh, they're scoring 24 points for Kobe, you know, or I scored, they made eight free throws in a row for Kobe or whatever else. They were, I mean, they were just doing all kinds of a number of things, but I pointed out Tiger Woods equals the same as Kobe Bean Bryant. They both equal 54 and 135. And, you know, Kobe's rape case in Eagle, Colorado and... A, a number of other things. It was an eagle putt. Tiger Woods, he got married on Kobe Bryant's birthday. And anyway, I just, I'm, I'm just making a point here that he was connected to Kobe Bryant. And if you go, let me find it here. If you go from the day that he made that eagle putt to today of this story, it's 54 days. Remember how Kobe being Bryant equals 54 and he died five months and four days after his birthday. And Tiger Woods equals 54. Somebody pointed out to me, too, that earlier this year, the LSU Tigers beat the Clemson Tigers in the college football championship. And, you know, that's interesting. Think about Louisiana. And I've talked about how Louisiana and the Francis Bacon Ciphers also equals 201, just like Tiger. Just like quarantine style, just like event 201. Somebody else also pointed out this Sri Lanka attack last year. And I just typed it in on my blog to see if I even blogged about it. And there was an attack in Sri Lanka and they alleged that it was this group called the Tigers of Tamil who might have been responsible for it. And... Back then, I talked about a tiger theme last year, so interesting. You know, there was a Tiger Woods that won the Masters, and then there was a story of a tiger who attacked a zookeeper in Kansas, and I got this strange comment on one of my old videos about the exorcism in Erling, Iowa, and their picture was a tiger, I believe it was, and... There was some guys that were went to smoke weed and they found a tiger, I think, in like maybe in Oklahoma or Texas or something like that back in February that year. And so, I don't know. Sri Lanka equals 59, just like the word tiger. And I just wondered, because last year, too, that was important to lion. There was a big lion theme 
that I mentioned in the previous video, how Tisha Bob fell on World Lion Day, and this year, International Tiger Day is the day that Tisha Bob begins. So there's some connection there between Tisha Bob and cats, basically. And I wonder if it's just it has to do with the word cat, because the word cat in Gematria equals 6 and 24. Cat, 6 and 24. And the two base ciphers, these are the reverse methods and so on. The alphabetic order and then the alphabetic order with the rules of numerology, it equals 6 and 24. And in my previous video, I talked about how this number is really, really important to the Detroit Tigers because Detroit Tigers equals 624 and Rocky Colavito, the guy who played with the Al Kaline, with the, or however you say his name, Al Kaline. Rocky Colavito, the guy who cursed the Cleveland Indians, he got traded to the Detroit Tigers. Rocky Colavito equals 624. Detroit Tigers equals 624. I'm, I'm not going to re-explain it all, but also King Charles III equals 624 in the Satanic Ciphers. Yeah, so I just wonder if that's, that's something important to it. I even mentioned how it was important to my grandma, who died six months and 24 days before my uncle who died six months and 24 days before my birthday. And I find that interesting only because the day that my grandma died, the, the night before, somebody wrote on Facebook how they found these baby kittens and they needed to be nursed. And I just so happened to have a cat that was nursing baby kittens at the time. And I was like, oh, you can bring them over. And we'll, we'll see if they'll latch on or whatever. And she brought them over that night. And the next day, the the cats had died. They they were, like, really weak when they got there anyway. And the cats didn't make it. And after the I woke up and found the dead cats or whatever, I then I found out that my grandma died that morning too. So, you know, something to do with cats. It's just interesting. And... Then, you know, a few months later, my son was born, and my son was born six months and 24 days after 624, and then my uncle died, and the reason I'm bringing all this up is because my uncle before that had died in 2017 as well, and just before he died, my mom's cat went missing, and... It was synced up to the number 114, you know, and then my uncle ended up dying on January 14th, and it was all synced up to the Chicago Cubs winning the World Series in their 114th season being called the Cubs, and the word tie equals 114, and, you know, a whole bunch of other things along with it. I, I'm not going to re-explain that either. I've talked about that countless times, but the Cubs had had the first tie since 2005, and my uncle had went to a game on 8-8. In 2005, and he went to the Detroit Reds game, and or not Detroit Reds, the Cincinnati Reds versus the Houston Astros, and the Houston Astros were the team who tied in 2005 or whatever, 114 days before the World Series when they lost to the Chicago team, and the White Sox had won for the first time in 88 seasons, and so on. But said so I wasn't going to talk more about it, but. It just makes me wonder. There's something to do with cats and how it syncs up to the number 624. The, the word cat equals 6 and 24. So just pointing that out. There was a tiger theme last year, but the, the lion theme was way bigger last year. So we got lions, tigers. Maybe next year we'll get a bunch of stuff about bears. You know, lions, tigers, and bears. But... I think I made my point. Just wanted, really, just wanted to make the point that talked about Tiger Woods with all this Tiger symbolism, and then now Tiger Woods is in the news, and they even highlight the phrase "quarantine," whatever it was. Can't remember what it was now. Quarantine style that equals two hundred one, which is the whole reason I even noticed that Tiger Tigers were important to all of this big narrative that's going on with coronavirus and so on. And sometimes I wonder if they just I, it, maybe it sounds, you know, arrogant or something, but I'm either, like, so spot on on figuring out the patterns that exist, or sometimes I feel like they're just making these news stories and highlighting stuff like this on purpose 
just so I'll see it and, you know, laugh or just maybe mocking or whatever, you know. And it, because it happens just so often, it's just so ridiculous, so. Who knows, but. I had a bunch of synchronicity tonight, but like I said, I'm, I'm super tired. I stayed up until like 5 in the morning last night. Then I had to go to my job and whatever, so. Have a good one. I'm not going to ramble. Peace.